Hi friends! Welcome back to our second video. We're going to be learning about how to write a letter. So, I want you guys to pay very close attention because at the end of our book, you guys are going to be writing your own letter. Alright friends, so we'll just dive right on in. So, the first part we have here is the greeting. And the greeting is how we basically start out our letter. So, some common greetings. People usually say, dear, dear Mrs. Blank, or dear Blank. Some people say, hello, Blank. Or people will say, greetings, Blank. After the greeting, there is always a comma. So in this case, he says, dear Mrs. LaRue, comma. Next, we have the date, a very important part of our letter because people want to know um, when it was written. So we have our date, and our date is always in the right-hand corner of our letter. And then we have our body, the body of our letter. Basically, all of the writing that's included within your letter, all of your ideas that you're writing down. Next, we have our closing. Closing. So in this case, Ike used sincerely. After your closing, there's always a comma as well. Some other com common closings that you can use at the end of your letter is kind regards, best wishes, with appreciation, respectfully, thank you, best, or cordially. Those ones are usually for people that you um, have a professional relationship with. Um, if you are writing like one of your family members, like your mom or your grandma, you can say love or always um, for your closing. Um, depending on what you know about the person and what your relationship is to them, your closing might be different. Cool. And the next one we have is P.S. How many of you guys have um, seen a letter that says P.S. and then it has a statement at the end? Well. P.S. stands for post scriptum. It's a Latin word meaning written after. So let's say you forgot to write something in your letter, um, but you want to make sure that the person knows about it. At the end of your letter, you write P.S. and you can write whatever you might have forgotten. So we just went over the parts of a letter. I hope you enjoyed the video. And we'll get started with our reading. See you later.